Okay, so uh, I'm here with you today, Paula. Nice to meet Hi. you. Hello. Uh, nice to meet you. <laughs> now, I was going to ask you, where have you been? Where I mean, I know you've been, been off in the Amazing Race, but apart from that, where have you been? You've been abroad working? Um, at the moment, I've actually been touring. Touring, I feel like a singer. I've actually <laughs> been going around um, to a lot of the neighboring countries like Philippines, Singapore, Malaysia and stuff. Like, um, just meeting up with the other amazing races and stuff and also like working in respective countries. Okay. Like sometimes like, they come to Thailand and do some work here as well and we like trade. I go over there, do some interviews, stuff like that. So it's been good. It's just been like traveling around, working. So you're still on the amazing race? Bandwagon Literally, my life on. is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, are you doing any other work, like movies or anything? Um, at the moment, I haven't accepted any movies or TV dramas, but just been working. At the moment, I'm kind of uh, working out of Thailand again because before, before I actually started with working outside of Thailand, so now I'm just like getting back into doing that. Okay, w would you prefer to be working back in Thailand, or are you happy being abroad? Um, I've just. I've just gone into my comfort zone. I think I need some challenges, so I just need to get out there and do new things again. So it's just basically for, for example, more a challenge. Just like starting the whole, like, I mean, in Thailand, um, I have enough work. I work all the time anyway. It's comfortable, it's easy. But it's just gotten to the point where it's kind of like, it's too easy for me now. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying it's too easy, but you know, I just want to challenge myself. So like, I've been trying to work in Japan a bit, which is hard. I mean, you have to do the whole, you have to start from scratch. They don't know you, so you have to go there and say, hi, my name's Paula, blah, blah, They either like you, they don't like you. You know, do the whole model circuit starting from scratch, which, which isn't easy, but. Have you tried just, like so. dressing up like manga, you know? <laughs> yeah, maybe I'll get more work. No, no. Short oh dresses. my God. <laughs> no, it's going okay. It's, it's pretty good. It's pretty fun, challenging. Mm -hmm. Okay, and like, I guess if, if you're working abroad, you're like one of the, the, the big names abroad for Thai people. Do you, yeah, do you see yourself I'm not as really like doing, a... I'm not really doing anything much. It's just more little challenges for myself. I haven't really gotten anything like too, like, too fantastic yet. But it's okay. But could, could you see yourself as a pioneer of... Pioneer? Um, I don't know about um, pioneering, but um, I don't know. We'll see. Wait, we'll, we'll, if I do succeed in what I'm doing, then... I'll get back to you that. Okay. All right, and going back onto the amazing race, uh, people have asked to find out what was your worst experience. The Forget worst? all the good stuff. What was the worst thing the that happened? Worst? I think getting to the intersection and realizing we had to wait for Henry and Terry for five hours was pretty crap. Yeah, you look kind of. You look kind of <laughs> we were screwed. Yeah, it was really. Um, it was quite a torturous five hours. And was was she as like as she looked? Terry. The, um, yeah. <laughs> Which is scary, basically. Um, during that time, it was quite scary. But I mean, that's just during race mode. Outside the race, she's fine. Yeah. Yeah, I've been like to dinner with her and everything. She's not that scary. All right, moving back into Thailand. <laughs> now, you're like the face of, I don't know, like a thousand brands here. Is that a right? A thousand brands? Yeah, that's I quite a lot. It, I saw you on the face of What the hell can I sell for a thousand things? <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you for that. But, uh, well, I just, there's, there's a big topic at the moment about uh -huh. fake goods uh -huh. being produced in Thailand. I was wondering, as you are the face of so many big brands, how do you feel about, you know, copied goods taking over big business? I don't like really that? like, I don't, it's an upset on that. I don't, I don't like the fake goods because I mean, people like brands and stuff, they work so hard on pine, like, you know, making this product and then other people like go and make it for like half price and you know, just, and you know what, at the end of the day, the quality is not there. Mm -hmm. So I don't know. I just, so you don't, you don't buy any fake goods? No, I don't. No okay. fake DVDs? Fake CDs? Fake clothes? No, I'm actually, especially being in the business, like you try not to because you understand how hard, like what work they go through to do it. So like I always like CDs and stuff, I always like buy the real thing. Cause it's just like, it's for me, I feel as though it's like, I'm letting that person know that, hey, I like your work. It's just like one vote for you, you know? So I get back to um, the whole reality TV thing. Were you to do another show? in the vein of reality TV, uh -huh. what would it be? Any ideas? I don't know. You know, I've never really thought of myself as being a reality star, but if you want to call it that. But um, I don't think I've ever thought about entering any, it's at the Amazing Race, basically because I like the concept of, you know, you travel, you do challenges. It's, it's just so much fun. I mean, I don't think you'll see me on Big Brother. I don't think I'll be doing any of those shows. I don't sing. Let it all go and just walk no. around naked on Big Brother. <laughs> No, I can't see myself doing that. No, I don't think I can see myself doing anything but Amazing Race. 
So I would like to do it again. Let's enter. You would do it again? Yep. Would you do a third world amazing race? Yeah, why not? Like we send you to Zambia. And why not? Sierra Leone. Okay. And you have to help. Bring it on. Yeah? Alright. Bring it on. I'm going to set that up. Okay, get, get do, do it. it. What's the longest that you've been here in Thailand? In one go? This year? Probably a week. I'm, yeah, I travel like all the time. I've been like crazy. January, I was in Thailand for maybe like 10 days, on and off. Yeah. So I have really, you should much. have won the amazing race because you're used to like going from here to here to here. You should... I mean, the, that's why I was always so happy because I mean, I wasn't really ever tired or anything like that because I'm used to all that. But um, I don't know. Present Guru for me in, in five words, even though you don't, you've never read it. Okay. Oh, <laughs> copy me. <laughs> I got to more fun. Um, uh, <laughs> 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 See, now I've got it twice. Okay, there you go. Good on you. Uh, thank you very much. That's fine. Thank you.